Yeah, I was just listening to the news and heard the word daycare centers, and I decided I hadn't really covered the word daycare, so I thought I'd just cover the word gay care. The government will put you know, or build in cities around the country daycare centers, and they will pay, you know, as uh, far as daycare, I don't think the government pays in the daycare center the people. Though the government will pay the people in the daycare center, let's say two or three hundred dollars, sixty percent, and the forty percent will go to pay the daycare center, you know, forty percent of two two or three hundred dollars an hour. And that's like I've heard of places where, you know, if you have to get away from your kid, you can bring your kid in to be watched by a professional. For, you know, however, if you just got to get away from your kid, you can bring your kids into these places. And then also, the, the government will pay a babysitter for you. I also decided that earlier, and I don't think I put it on here. I don't know, well, let's say a babysitter may get, oh, let's say, oh, $30 now, which, you know, like a 16-year-old babysitter that's a lot of money, and that'd be straight, and maybe, uh, maybe, uh, when you go, well, well, I'll change that. 60, 40, a babysitter might get paid 150, and you get 40% of that to go out. So let's say a babysitter 150, they get 60% of 150, and you get 40% of 150, uh, to go out for supper. And the hours would have to be a little different because it'd be after you get off work and you and your wife would go to supper and get paid to go to supper because you get for 40% to do the paperwork to pay the babysitter because you'd have to get 40% to handle the paperwork to get the baby babysitter paid and the babysitter would get 60% and there'd have to be some sort of organization to make sure the babysitter was qualified, so there's going to have to be an organization to qualify the babysitter, and you get paid 40% to, to handle the paperwork, and then the rest to go eat supper to pay the bill. Because, you know, you got to get away from your kids ever so often. So let's say, oh, four times a month, every weekend, you get to take the weekend for a meal, and for for the evening, the weekend, you get a day off from your kids. The government pays you to take time away from your kids, and it pays the babysitter to watch your kids. I always try to go, do a good deal, and you get time away from your kids, and the government pays it to watch the babysitter to watch your kids. And pays you to take time away from your kids to pay for your meal. And that covers it. And uh, I was doing the daycare center to watch your kids, uh, the younger kids, uh, during a certain time. You know, the, and also, uh, oh yeah, uh, I haven't mentioned, uh, uh, what do you call it, adoption, or uh, uh, what do you call it when they're, uh, oh, uh, when they're, they're not, not up for adoption, but uh, what do you call them? Uh, oh, kids are in orphanages. The government will pay, will run orphanages, and they'll get paid better. Let's say if you're running an orphanage and working in an orphanage, they'll get $300 an hour, 60%, because they got to be qualified. The orphanages get 40% of $300 an hour, and if you're working in an orphanage, you get 60% $300 to work in it, or if you're nursing an orphanage, that may be a nurse's salary, which is like, I think, $600 an hour or nursing an orphanage, but just a regular person in an orphanage, to, you know, working in there. And uh, the orphanage, or, you know, will get paid better. The government will, will give money to orphanage. Oh, that ain't saying it right. But they'll get paid better for kids in orphanages. And uh, 
I want do I want to do better deals than the government's done so far. And this money comes from nowhere, like I've said a lot, it's zipped down a wire, just electricity at the clock runs. 